Hey, Long Riders! Welcome to episode two of The Proof. And I wanted to ask you how many of you guys remember this. I guarantee we will. They will take that fly. We will catch fish on this fly. I guarantee we will. Ha! That came true. And we'll tell you in a second how, and you don't want to miss this video, some nice fish in this video, some pretty big brownies. We'll be back in a second. Hey, welcome back. Yes, we were fishing up Pines Creek and the water had been high. The water's been high since May here in Pennsylvania for the most part. And so we were fishing in May on Pine Creek, or just a couple weeks ago on Pine Pine Creek, the water had come down a little bit so it was weightable, but it was still really high. And the fish had moved into the banks, right along the banks, which if you have high water, that's what they'll do. They'll move right in along the banks and they'll find a deep hole right along a bank. They're a lot of time broken by maybe a log sticking out or something like that to break the current, and that's where they'll lay. So a lot of times in high water, a lot of fly, fly fishing will go out and they'll fish right along the bank. <coughs> And they don't have to wait and they catch a, have a lot of action. So that's how you fish a high water situation. But anyway, let's get to the fishing on Pine Creek where we catch a really nice brown. And we'll come back and talk about the fly we used and what the deal was.
Okay, welcome back. We used that really si sized little teeny 18 uh, fly. I'll uh, put down around here somewhere how to tie it. But it was a size 18. We tied it for Christmas, so we tied it with like, I knew it, it would probably work for like a small stockies or I didn't know it would do so well for uh, all the fishing we did. I went, I tied 10 of them that day and I am out from either fish stealing them because I was using 5X, which I caught that big brown on 5X. It had a uh, jig hook, uh, tungsten bead, jig fly with that little uh, fly hung and off the back that size 18, I think it was a size 18 2X, so it would be actually a shank size of 16. That uh, fly was remarkable. I mean, I can't believe how many fish I caught on it. Um, I uh, made a video a while back where a real big one got away on white deer. That was on that fly, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was on that fly. And uh, I had a couple get away this year off that fly. I had a couple big, big fish snap that fly off. This one unfortunately didn't. And uh, so I bring you this episode too. And if you don't know what the proof is, there's episodes where I tie a fly. I take it to the water and catch a fish on it, and uh, we'll be a lot of these because most of the flies that I tie, I end up catching the fish on, and this gives you guys a little idea that, yeah, even though some of these flies, like this one was kind of ridiculous, it was a uh, yellow body, purple thorax, uh, flashback wrapped over out of the thorax, and uh, legs tied in like one of them cross, little black legs tied in a cross pattern. And uh, I had an idea it would work for like in the winter, you know, or fishing it deep would work, but never I, did I think that I would catch it along the bank in a foot of water and a giant brown and get it in on 5X. So all this was you don't, don't have to, uh, for big browns, don't have to fish 3X or even 4X if you're fishing small flies. Uh, it's easy to catch a big fish on four, five X, and you don't have to not muscle them in. I muscled this thing in. So, thank you for watching my videos. Right here is a bunch, and we're almost at 2,000 subscribers. So tell your friends, um, get everybody to get together, uh, subscribe, and we'll be doing another 2,000 subscriber giveaway. We did one at 1,000. And we, we're really close to 2,000. So tell your friends and make sure if you're on YouTube watching it or Facebook or whatever on a group or something, make sure you subscribe to my little face down there because you got, don't want to miss our videos. We make some amazing videos. We've got over 200 time videos. You just don't want to miss it. So check out our other videos. Make sure you click to subscribe. Keep your lines wet out of trees and only give them fish. A sort of